When I turned in those 1,000 cereal box tops for a time machine, I figured it was just for fun. Little did I know that the Fundy Atheist had invented a time machine of their own. Am I a dog that thou comest to me with the staves? Come to me, and I will give thy flesh unto the fowls of the air and to the beasts of the field. Uh huh, 1025 BC. It looks like I'm just in time. Um, keep two of those stones loaded and ready. You'll need them. Here, kid. Go buy yourself a frozen yogurt. Okay, big shot. Here's the deal. J.P. Holding, Temporal Apologetics Enforcement Division. Exactly how tall are you? How tall am I? Sheesh. Read my press clippings and find out. Just answer the question, please. Uh, six cubits in a span, okay? Uh, no, that's not okay. You see, in modern terms, that's 9 feet 9 inches tall. And no one gets that tall without serious health problems that wouldn't serve them as a warrior. What's your point? The point is, Big Shot, that the Masoretic text, from which we get the bulk of our evidence for the Hebrew translation of the Old Testament, does say that you're six cubits in a span. But there's much more substantial textual and literary evidence to indicate that the proper reading of your height is four cubits in a span. In other words, only six feet, nine inches tall. Oh yeah? And what do you plan to do about it, wise guy? Oh, this. Have at it, David. Thou comest to me with a sword, and with a spear, and with a shield. That I come to thee in the name of the Lord of hosts, the God of the armies of Israel, whom thou hast defied. This day will the Lord deliver thee into mine hand, and I will smite thee and take thine head from thee. And I will give the carcasses of the host of the Philistines this day unto the fowls of the air and to the wild beasts of the earth, that all the earth may know that there is a God in Israel. And all this assembly shall know that the Lord saveth not with sword and spear, for the battle is the Lord's, and he will give you unto our hands. Uh-huh, as I figured. Ah, oh, crud. What's going on here? Oh, it's pretty simple, David. There's a group of fundy atheists like this guy who got hold of a time machine, and they're doing all they can to foul up biblical history. My job is to go back and stop them. Oh, I see. Well, see you around maybe some other time, eh? Hey, wait a minute. What do I do now? Oh, same thing you were going to do before. Have at it. Thou comest to me with a sword, and with a spear, and with a shield, that I come to thee in the name of the Lord of hosts, the God of the armies of- <laughs> Eh, you heard it once already. <laughs> <laughs>